she won't. Well, I'm sure you're right about that. Charlotte has no intention of leaving town, and neither do her parents. Her parents? Are they here? Well, you haven't had the pleasure. Neil and Una, McSweeney is the name they use. A poor, pathetic pair. Seems they're refugees from a terrorist mutiny. Who are they really? That's what I'm going to find out. Frank, don't. Now, you just tell me what Charlotte said. Everything. All that she said, I want to hear it all. When did you last see her? After you came and told me that she'd confessed that I was involved, I knew that you were bluffing. That was also right. I went down there and I confronted her and I demanded that she leave town. The terms of our agreement were that I was to pay her an annual sum for her silence. Well, I threatened to cut it off and she just laughed in my face. Yeah, I was right about that, too. I knew all along she wanted more than money. They want revenge. For what? I don't know. But whatever it is, that girl believes in it, body and soul. Vengeance just burns inside her. It blazes out of her. Well, she can go to blazes before I will, and you can, too. Frank, listen, I am afraid for you. <sighs> They've used me from the very beginning. She got a lot of pleasure out of telling me that. Her eyes are... They will step over my body if they've got to to get to you. They've got a plan for you. They want death and dishonor for your whole family. You've got to get all of us out of this. That's exactly what I intend to do, Ray. I've managed to keep one step ahead of them this far. I think you've got to back off from her. I think don't see her anymore. Refuse all contact. No more calls, no more meetings. Get out of town for a while if you have to. Maybe if she can't get in touch with you, she'll give up. Give up? Charlotte? <laughs> Apparently you don't know her as well as I do. Charlotte does not give up. I've tried to disconnect with Charlotte. She manages somehow to stay in touch. She can't be there in person. She'll find some other way. She'll turn into the air and make you breathe her well, in. Well, then how do you plan to stop them? How do you plan to get rid of her? By gaining their confidence. What are you talking about? My plan is to make them believe that I buy their story. They already know that I'm checking it out. And then little by little, they will come to trust that I am doing exactly what they want me to do. The fact is, though, that they will be playing my game. What are you going to do about me? You? Yeah. You mean, am I going to prosecute? No. Not for the time being, as long as you keep your mouth shut. But mark my words, Ray. If you breathe even one word of this to them, then you are very quickly going to find yourself serving time. Now, you know I'll do that, don't you, Ray? Yes. Yes, I know. But you don't have to worry about me getting in touch with Charlotte. I'm on the ruthless side, but I do not warm up to killers. Please, be careful with them. It's nice to know you care. <laughs>